Good day everyone and welcome to Clara's creation. Myself, Clara, the creator of Clara's creation, presents a unit of standard five English prose lesson transformed into a poem. Helen Keller, a poem penned down by Clara Rodriguez. Here is an image of your textbook. Helen Keller lesson, a prose unit. I took this image from your Balbati textbook. And I thought of transforming. Students, please bear with me. Due to bad weather, my voice is slightly affected. I repeat, this is a unit from the standard five English textbook. Helen Keller, I thought of transforming this prose lesson into a poem to give you a better impact. Normally children, we dislike poetry comprehension. But this particular lesson is taught to you as a prose unit already in your class and when that same lesson is transformed into a poem my personal opinion is you'll be able to handle and tackle poetry comprehension better because you have heard the explanation and you have the explanation in a text form in a prose form already with you and same lesson when you listen in a poetic form the impact is totally different so certain incidents chapter from helen taylor's life i have transformed into a poem here is an image of a little girl in pink and she is Helen Keller. And the lady besides her is a teacher who changed her life completely. So without wasting time, let's listen to the poem, Helen Keller. At young age, she lost her yearning sense and eyesight. With her destiny, she had a tough fight. Yes, at a young age, yes, at a young age, she showed great courage. It was her teacher who helped her to shape and step forward towards a bright future. It's rightly said, a teacher can break or make a child. Determination of a mother, efforts of a teacher, a blind little light in many parts, fought with the darkness within her, in many hearts, left her imprints, inspired William to follow her footprint. Who says a disability can't be an author? Disability didn't stop her from being a great writer. New era was written in mankind. Author, writer, lecturer, political activist, advocate of disabled right. Yes, you heard it right. Advocate of a disabled right stood up for disabled, fought for every disabled's right through her work. Hats off to a great teacher, Annie Sylvan. Who taught Helen to fight with the darkness and lead kind of light. And through her life, she proved 
disability is not a blood i'm sorry and through her life she proved disability is not a battle of individual yes disability is not a battle of a individual but is a fault that lies in opposite persons eyesight i would like to read the last verse again who fought who taught helen to fight with the darkness and lead kind of light and through her life she proved disability is not a battle of an individual but is a fault that lies in the opposite persons eyesight If you're enjoying poems from Clara's creation and videos of Clara's creation, do not forget to subscribe Clara's creation.